News 8 at 6 continues. We all know the RIT Tigers wear orange on the field, but their president is showing off his green ideas. You might catch him on campus or around town on a new bike that runs on batteries. News 8 7 Axel Bank has more in this Go Green report. It's unorthodox, but it works. Every university president should be a little quirky anyway, just to generate some community interest. RIT President Bill Dessler has turned his ordinary bike into a motorbike of sorts. He designed it himself to run on a backseat battery that can power him 20 miles an hour when he doesn't feel like pedaling. We needed a car to catch up to him on campus. It takes the intimidation out of going out and riding because, you know, for most of us, we want to go out and ride, but then we say, you know, that last hill on the way home is really a dog, you know. But this, in this case, we just, uh, you know, ride away and don't fear the last hill because we know we can get up it. President Dessler rides eight miles back and forth to work every day on his bike, and he says his trips are a teachable moment for everyone in the community. If we're going to move towards a future in which we don't assume that the world is a hollow sphere filled with oil, and last time I checked it is not, then we're going to have to find more efficient modes of transportation, and this is a step in that direction. The battery bike gets the equivalent of 1,500 miles to the gallon. He built this version earlier this month, so he's not yet ready for something new. But one day, he will be. Or maybe put wings on it or something. The president of RIT is ahead of the curve on the road to a greener world. At RIT, Evan Axelbank, News 8. One day we'll see Dessler flying over the city skyline. Uh, there's much more to this story, as you know. It's a lithium battery in the <laughs> it's bike. It's a lithium battery. And the, the wings are still, as far as we know, a ways yeah, away. But I do hope to see him someday fly. Yeah, that would be really neat. Credit for hey, it, you know? Hey, and it'll happen at RIT first, I guarantee yeah. you that. <laughs>